everybody, I'm Yogita Bihani. I'm an actor by profession and a die-hard foodie. <laughs> when I was a little girl, I would daydream about being on television and at night, I would dream about having my own restaurant. Perfect, right? <laughs> so when I was in school, I would participate in all the functions, Children's Day, Teacher's Day, competitions, you name it. I would be right there on the stage, front line, full star material. I actor a good but a problem. I was born in a typical Marwadi family. Back to a girl. <laughs> Let me give you some information about my family. So I come from a typical Rajasthani family. I'm sure you must have seen those films and daily soaps. Exactly. Same to same. So it's the nine of us in our family. My mom, my dad, my daddy, and the rest, six of us. We are the siblings. Yes, the, <laughs> the six siblings, five sisters, one brother. I'm sure you've got it by now. Like every time a baby girl is born in our family, the relatives would call and they say, it's okay, next time try it, it will be a girl. Yes, that. So while I was growing up, I realized that my brother was the privileged son of the family. And us, the daughters, he was just karkis. It wasn't that we were not sent to school or we were not given education. Of course, that was given. But the ultimate goal of our lives was to become the bahu of another house and to get married to another privileged son. All my sisters are married and they are happy. But I didn't want that for myself. I wanted to do something different. I don't know what. I had no idea, but I knew that I don't want to become a responsibility. I did computer science honors because my brother and my father asked me to. They thought it'd be perfect for me. I would do a nine to five job and yeah, that'd be great, but it wasn't. So there came my first opportunity, all right? Um, there was a show called Femme Foodies and it was a show uh, based in Goa. Whoever wins this show, gets a food truck of, one, of her own and I gave an audition and I got a call back when I got a call back I was jumping I was jumping on my bed on the floor everywhere because I was so happy because I realized this was it this is what I had been waiting for because I didn't know what to do and this is it I love food and I want to have my own restaurant and it will take me to television remember the little girl who had those dreams yes this was the perfect opportunity for me and I was ready to you know take on it but then came the reality my family you know how a normal family would react to it if you tell them that your kid is going to be on television they would jump on it but my family was more concerned what I would wear on that show because I was going to go to Goa and she would wear dresses what would my mama think what would my masi think what would my bua think was the priority and not my dream I was not going to go on a dating show I was not doing any of those shows I was doing a cooking show which was legit and it was going to come on living foods now ZZS but I was shook and I stood for myself and I said, no, you have to understand that what you say is not different from it. What you want to do with your daughter is different from it. What clothes I'm going to wear on that show doesn't matter. Your daughter is going to be on that show. That matters. And after a lot of drama, they finally agreed. And I went to that show. I didn't win the show, but it was a great experience. And I came back and I started to get a lot of calls for TVCs. And uh, I got them and my family was happy to see me on the television. And the transition was nice because I'd already be on, been on TV. So they didn't have any problem because they were like, okay, it's happening and she's happy and we are seeing, seeing her on television. It's great. But 
uh, after a few months it was time for my brother to get married and uh, while there were rishtas coming and everything was happening at that time i done a tv commercial where i had worn a bikini not a two piece bikini a one piece bikini a one piece swimsuit with a sarong so the ladki wale they saw that tv commercial and they called up my family and they said um aapke ghar ki beti agar aise kapde pehenti hai to aap kis type ki family ho so basically wo apne ghar ki izzat हमारे घर की इज्जत से देख रहे थे इट वॉज अ लॉट टू टेक ऑन एंड इमिडिएटली द क्वेश्चन वॉज इफ योर करियर चॉइस एंड इफ योर चॉइस आर सच अ बिग प्रॉब्लम फॉर योर ब्रदर्स मैरिज देन हाउ वुड यू गेट मैरिड एंड आई वॉज इन शॉक दैट इवन आफ्टर आई हैव कम सो लॉन्ग आई हैव चेंज माई पार्ट्स आई हैव चेंज माई ड्रीम्स the ultimate goal of my family <laughs> is to get me married is finally who would she get married to will anybody accept her but i was not going to give up i was i was so close to my dreams i was live i was actually living my dream i would not give up and i told my family because you know they they said that हमारी बरादरी में इन आवर सोसाइटी नो बड़ी हैज डन दिस एव आई डोंट माई मदर लेट्स आस बी द फर्स्ट फैमिली लेट्स आस चेंज इट लेट लेट आस चेंज इट राइट इफ नो बड़ी हैज एवर डन इट लेट मी डू इट मे बी सम बडी सम फैमिली विल सी आस चेंजिंग एंड दे विल चेंज एंड दैट विल चेंज अनादर फैमिली एंड दैट विल चेंज अनादर टेन फैमिली another 10 families and that will change the society let us bring the change let us dream and yes they changed now today when my mother sees me romancing another guy on tv she is not worried about what the society will say she wants me to have the same romantic life in real also my father when he went to jewelry shopping for my brother's wedding he was showing off my jewelry at and my brother him and i have discussions about my nose job <laughs> so yes this is my success story this is what i have done i have modernized my family so today when a baby girl is born in our family relatives abhi bhi call karke wahi bolte hain next time try kar lena ladka ho jayega i can't change that but at least that baby girl will have you with a behind to look up to thank you